Well, well listen, we've, you can see we've obviously had a little bit of a dress up here. Uh, Philip and Holly, they're attempting to outdo us uh, with their Halloween transformations as we speak. I don't think they're going to. I don't think they're going to do it. No. Um, but will they match the power of the mighty male Ifferson? <gasps> male. See what you've done Ifferson. there. See what I've done. Male Ifferson. Male Ifferson. <laughs> Male You look amazing. Wait, this is my oh, casual yeah. outfit from home. Done me makeup in the car. <laughs> Honestly. Right, are you feeling it? I'm feeling I'm feeling fresh. <laughs> but I'm not feeling like you. These legs What's are gonna get on my nerves. They're today. not legs, babes. Oh, sorry, these They're tentacles. tentacles. You right. look amazing. Who are these? Thank you. Well, these guys are my mermen. Right. And they do everything I do, basically. They go anywhere I go. Do they? Do you wanna watch? Go on. Look, step to the left. Look at that. Step Look to the that. right. Oh, this is Money unbelievable. Man. Yeah, they look See, thrilled to be doing they that. They do what I do. They look thrilled. They look beautiful, don't, don't they? They do. They look amazing, but not as amazing as you. Thank they you really, really don't. You look. We've made. It's nice to see please you. Don't touch me. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> right. First, though, it is time for the moment we've all been waiting for. <laughs> don't like it. I love the tail action. Do more. Entrance. What a I face. mean, literally, that's the most terrifying thing I've ever seen. Oh, I don't like it. Oh, well it's done. Eyes. It's the eyes. Oh, my goodness me. Well, this is an incredible transformation, obviously, and it's taken an awful lot of work, as you can see. So let's find out a little bit more about it, did we? So so tell us, who, who, who are you and why did you want to be this character? So, so much. I am the Night King from Game of Thrones, and I can't tell you what a massive fan I am of the show, and the chance to do this was just something I couldn't possibly pass up. OK, I don't mean to point out the obvious here, but why aren't you actually just speaking? Because the Night King doesn't speak, um, I think we all agreed that the first time he spoke, it wouldn't be a brilliant idea if it was my voice. So I'm remaining totally in character. That's a good point. Here, we've got, specially for you, we've got some witchy fingers. Hang on. Yeah, Not these witchy fingers, bringing I you in these for, to um, a witchy finger. Halloween last year. Here we go. What do you think of that, Ryland? Is it alive? No. Yep. Here we go. There's a little witchy finger. <laughs> <laughs> Stop it. I knew this would go wrong. <laughs> do you like that? <laughs> it was an automatic reaction. Would you like one in the other hand as well? There you go. Are you going to eat it? No. No, he's Your grip not. instantly got he's... tighter. <laughs> Go on, have a taste. The fun of the fake. Go on. Do you know what it is? Because, yeah. that, because <laughs> that won't be in the newspapers at all tomorrow. Is it? Will it? They're not a dog. Yes, it's it is. Well done. There have a look at it, go. though. It's like a finger shape. Hang on, hang on, hang on. Let's take you off. Mind the air, mind the mind air. Mind the hair. Oh, I can go so off at any moment. <laughs> And I'm slightly more frightened by the fact that you've this character has overtaken. I have been overcome! What are you what have you done with Philip Schofield? <laughs> Bring him back! Hi! How are you? Don't say the B-word! <laughs> <laughs> that is so good! <sighs> How are we gonna focus on the whole show today? Now How am I gonna like... take a selfie? Look I... at my nails! It's the attention <laughs> to can you see these nails? Come and look at these nails, look. Look. And it's what these nails do to him that is the scary thing. He's kind of walking around like this. That's amazing. Can I just say well done to our hair and makeup department who literally had an hour to put all this together. That was just phenomenal. Well done. Oh, I've got a great big belly in this. Look. <laughs> Brilliant. Thank you very much to the actors who took a break from scaring everyone at the London. It only had half an hour, by the way. Was it only half an hour? Half an hour oh to do gosh, this. Even better. Yeah. Amazing. <laughs> Start doing that. Yeah. Oh, you've got like lipstick on your teeth. Oh, I got something <laughs> on my teeth. Could you check my teeth? It is so wrong. Do I have something in my teeth? 
<laughs> you are really enjoying this, aren't you? Better than any. <laughs> and then literally move it out of the way like so. Actually, Holly, yeah. I need, can you get some jam? Some jam in that fridge. I forgot to get it out. We've been mucking about today. So you need to just cut... I didn't even here. know this fridge worked. It's not a jam. No? What, why is there a bear... Thank you. Did you all just see that happen? Or is that just... Come on, hurry up, back with the jam. Did Thank see you, what darling. happened? Thank you. That was a bit scary, wasn't it? See what happened? Philip? Something very small, all dressed in Victorian clothes, just gave me some jam. No, Philip, hold no that. one saw anything. Just hold that. I'll see you to... <laughs> some... okay. I didn't know until about ten minutes before. They were like, do you mind just popping this cloak on and uh, scaring the car? I was like, yeah, sure, no worries. The scythe was real. Eh? It was a real metal... <laughs> Oh, that was so close. <laughs> that was so close. <laughs> that was for you, Shirzy. We that... got you back. <laughs> Could have been the end. <laughs> Could have been the end. <laughs> Did you nearly swear? <laughs> <laughs> I will. I will. Sorry, mate. We won't put you back. Four in years of work to get to where I am. <sighs> and it, it was nearly all over. <laughs> nearly all over. In a flash for an Did you nearly resign on television then? <laughs> yeah, I literally. Oh, you are. So, Martin Frizzell, you are so lucky. <laughs> <laughs> you are so lucky to have read it. Two, Two one. one. Here we go. Right, so they're on the floor and then Dr. Ranch is really going for it. Dr. Zoe's there. Hoping she stays oh, in that outfit. <laughs> Ranch is really having a good old go. Alice Pierce nice. is taking off. Alice, you can't pick him up by your head. Dr. Rand is having a go. Oh, there was, there was a little bit of a clash there between Dr. Rand and Dr. Zoe. Get back on your skateboard, Dr. Zoe. No, she's cheating there. That's a cheating. Get down, get down. Make sure you stay in that role. So I think there's a bit of foul play going on here. I'm not going to lie. Dr. Rand has taken a turn for the worst. Four, three, two, one. Time's up. No more balls. Ali's being no more balls. Stop, stop, stop. No more balls. You. I, I see you. You stay there and all. Don't you point your witchy finger at me. Don't you right. start. I have never over in my life seen cheating <laughs> like that. Oh, my God! <laughs> she got off the thing. Look at right. her balls. She didn't. Oh, oh, my God. God. OK, the boys have got up to oh, two oh, lines. The boys have got up to two lines. Do you know what, Ryland? Oh. It serves them right, because <laughs> they cheated, right? They cheated, and then Holly moved the balls, and they all came out. Well, it... Yeah, it, it that, what? It <laughs> well, serves you right for cheating. Serves you right for cheating. We can declare <laughs> the Phillips team are the winners. That's yeah! what you get for cheating. Don't you throw that. Don't you throw that at us. Oh, oh cheat. my God! It's a trophy. It's a trophy. Can have me microphone. There you go. I want my trophy. I can't even see anything. <laughs> I can't do it. I can't breathe. Wait, I can't breathe. Get me out. Stop touching me! Oh my god! I can't even look at them. He's naked. Are you crying? You wet yourself. Look at Oh my god! wet yourself? I have. I'm so sorry, I didn't bring any ten in lady. Oh, I haven't got any. <laughs> it was like I was in a horror movie and I just couldn't get out of it. That just went on forever, didn't it? Now he's a tin man today and with no Wizard of Oz to ask for a heart, Phil Vickery's resorted to making one himself. And despite being in cake form, it's even going to beat just like the real thing. I mean, this is actually <laughs> disgusting. There it is. I look can't at even... <laughs> look at it beating. Hang on, hang on. Watch, watch, watch this one here. What are you about to right. do? Don't tell me blood's going to come out of it, because no, I will vomit. Look. 
It I is wanted to have no, look at that. Look. But you can eat that. Yes, of course you can. Well, sure. And it's made of what? Sponge and no, but sugar ice. I imagine you think yes, he likes that. He likes that. Right. Well, we'd come back to that. Let's talk about sponge first. Look, okay. Over here. This is a, a, what we call a velvet sponge, a velvet cake sponge. It's yeah. very light. It's a meringue-based one, but you can use any sponge you like. And I've coloured it with red colouring, but you need to add cocoa powder as well to get this lovely colour. Okay. Otherwise, it just looks pink. I mean, that is a beautiful cake. Does, yes. does the Night King like cake? Yeah, I'm going to be honest and say that being undead and, um, and having so much domination in mind, um, something sweet occasionally uh, would probably go down quite well. I know, nobody can resist a bit of cake, can Perfect. they? Just can't resist it.